The road was scheduled to be completed by November this year, but due to the floods, the deadline has now been extended. Despite floods, motorists can still drive from Katimamudilo to Luhonono, less than five kilometers. Where we are standing is about two kilometers to, to Luhonono. And um, the whole road, as we have seen, is now passable. And we are not yet const uh, uh, done. We are just busy now with the fill. And then the culvert here, we were, we were still, it was still under construction. But unfortunately, the flood came. But what makes us happy is that all the the uh, culverts and the three bridges which we we constructed managed to uh, accommodate the flow of water. And we have seen that this water was one of the the highest um, compared to the one 2018 as well as 2010. Lutombi says both the construction and the bridges are at 85 percent complete with about nine bigger culverts yet to be constructed. The roads authority is optimistic that the return of the same floods will not be able to wash away any culverts or bridges as this year's floods were among the biggest in recent years. As compared to previous floods where several parts of the roads were damaged by water, only one portion, less than 20 meters close to Luhonono, was washed away this year. We were supposed to complete the project um, in, uh, in June this year, end of June this year. However, we had some challenges with the lockdown and now the issue of the COVID-19 I mean, uh, COVID uh, and also the regulations observing that we won't be able to, to fast track the, pro the production so we'll have to gradually observing the uh, the social distancing at all our projects. So that uh, we anticipate that if the situation uh, continues like this, then we can only be able to deliver the road by January next year up to June. But if the situation improves, that uh, we are allowed now to uh, to work at full production, it's our intention to deliver this project by November. Residents of the floodplains we spoke to expressed their happiness. In the past, before the construction of this road, people were suffering, paddling from Ikava to Old Kave or Lusese, some to Izizwe. But now with this road, it has become easy for the people from Muzi and Kava Mkano. They just come to the road at Chukmansberg. We see that it is good though we wish this road could be extended to other far areas. With development, we are very happy. All we want is extension. Sidi Lombiana, NBC News, Katimamdilo.